Welcome to another Daily Dose of Drupal. Today we're on episode number 9 and we will be going over the global redirect module. Last time we talked about the redirect module and how that can be helpful for some search engine optimization reasons and we're also going to today look at the global redirect module and see how that can also help with your website's SEO. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to just look at our test site here and you can see we have this test page that we created last time. The URL is test-page2. However, because of the way Drupal handles its system URLs, if I go to node slash 12, I get to the same page. And you can find out the, the contents node ID if you hover over the edit and you look down here in the bottom corner says node slash 12 slash edit. So if I go to node slash 12 slash edit it brings me uh, to the node edit page but if I just go to node slash 12 it brings me to the node view page which is the same of course as just test dash page 2. So what could happen is it is possible for the search engine to index a page twice using the node page and the actual URL alias that you set up. So just to make sure that's prevented, we can use the global redirect module. Uh, you can see what the global redirect module does. It does a, th I mean you can read through these on your own I suppose, but it, it'll do things just to make sure that all your URLs across your site are accessed in a consistent way. So there's only one true URL to get to a specific page. So we're going to go ahead and download that. And now that it's downloaded, we'll come back here and go to our modules page. And we will scroll down and find the global redirect module, which is right here. You can see that it stops duplicate content is the main goal of global redirect. So now that it's enabled, we'll go back to our home page. You can see if we go to node slash 12 now, you see how the URL now changed. If I add a slash at the end, you'll notice that it takes that URL out. So it's a very simple module and it only does one thing but it does it very well. It makes sure that there's zero chance that your or that a search engine is going to find duplicate content on your site and it's going to make sure that URLs are only accessible through one specific unique URL rather than through multiple URLs which is what comes default with a new Drupal installation. So that's it for this time and if you have not already signed up for the CodeKarate.com newsletter, please do so and follow me on Twitter at S-M-T-H-O-M-A-S-3. Uh, and the reason I want you to do that is because I want you to let me know what videos you want to see. So if you have a module you'd like demonstrated or you have you know, a specific question, you contact me through my CodeKarate.com site or on Twitter and I will try to put a video up answering that. So until next time, this is the Daily Dose of Drupal. Thanks for watching.